All right, so so okay, so it's it's giant robots, but it's very small giant yes. robots. It's very yes and no. It's very small robots in in it, so it's Gundam, but it's not Gundam. It's it's, it's very Gunpla. small. It's what? It's Gunpla. Oh Jesus, Lord in heaven! <laughs> oh, hey everyone, welcome to the Dojo. I'm Rachel. I'm Jeff, and I'm Mike. Uh, I finally convinced him to touch a Gundam game. Well, see, ironically, no, no. no. <laughs> No, because last year's got a verse says I don't play games like that that are just like online only. Like I, or I also but it don't, wasn't online only. But well, but then the single player was just one of those Dissidia bullshit things, right? Where it was you one on one with something else. No, you fight like multiple random things, tiny like grunts, that sort of thing. I played the demo for that game, and the way that you were describing it is not what that game is. <laughs> it's still a fi- no, but it's still a fighting thing. It's just it's not. It doesn't have a story. Yeah, the Gundam Breaker games have stories. Uh, Okay. Yeah, they. I feel like Gundam is one of those things where I'm not reading any of this. This, this I'm love kind of Gunpla transcends I'm, culture and yeah. language barriers across the world. This school's success may predict Japan's future if these students could just build these tiny Gundams. Standing before the Gunbrae High School is alone. Transfer. Why does That's it? us. Oh, <laughs> fuck it. God damn it. Japan, there are things in the world that are not high school. I'm just going to tell you that. I don't know that you know that. Well, I have Gundam Breaker 3, and the story for Gundam Breaker 3 is somehow creepier to me uh-huh. because it doesn't say you're a high school student. It's just like a small... You just hang like, around high school? Yeah, you're, 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 you're in, in a parking ar- lot in a van. You're in an arcade, and the small teenager's like, you're awesome, you should join my team. I'm like, I'm like 25 or 28 at the time, or 27 at the time it came out. Yeah. I was like, this is creepy, but I'm sure, why not? <laughs> Goddamn, could you also have picked like a, a less readable font yeah like the skinniest <laughs> font in the entire world <laughs> and then you put horizontal lines behind it oh look it's our girlfriend she, well we've been friends since grade school i wonder if we are actually in love we always used to build guns together and make them battle what world is this it might be the build fighters world. oh my you god ever, do you know about the build fighters world no the, uh, there's a series of uh anime gundam anime called uh, gundam build fighters yeah where they make the gunpla and they put them in a machine and they fight the, with them no it's actually pretty fucking cool because you look i get some good like great mixtures of mobile suits it's really cool i've i've uh I've, I've looked around and i've decided that if it ain't like you see gundam i'm not fucking interested i don't give a shit about wing or like what's the one where it's like uh robot jocks or whatever is that zeta or like double G-Gundam. zeta or whatever g gundam G-Gundam. yeah double zeta is part of the uz timeline okay as uh, well as zeta yeah 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 um, G Gundam is uh, the super sh- uh, the, it's super Gundam fighter the super stereotype edition it's the best way of explaining G Gundam oh my Jesus Lord it's like God. Street Fighter Michael this girl's a nerd Fuck, we need to get away from her we're never gonna get in with the cool kids she's called us a new type the reformation of humanity wait are we in the Gundam universe or not because if we're not you're a nerd oh, she's a nerd you a big fat nerd well the main character in, in uh, Build Fighters is like a giant fucking nerd I, you know, okay, you know what I've... You know Why what, Gundam X, though? <laughs> you, you know, okay, you know what I've decided what is that? that, like, I am... I, I live in a weird world. I am not a fan of anime the way that people are fans of anime. Like, I just don't give a fuck about anime as much. I like it, but people just... They get really just... Grrr, like, charge, counterattack, kill yourself into Gundam, right? Like, you know, super fucking in, into anime. I feel like anime. we should just skip this. It has a button that says we can just skip this. No, we gotta find it. We don't... It, everybody always says that Rage Select skips the story. I want you guys to be able to know all the story. Yeah, the story oh, of the... the yeah. Old friend and, and the gunpla. Mm-hmm. And no, the, no, oh this, is, this is anime. They have really, really good stories. <laughs> no. We have to talk for 45 minutes before we can have a fight because, oh, you know... the bell. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The school's a mile away, Yui. <laughs> How are you going to get to class? You're dead. You're going to die on your She's way to class. She's going to ride her Gundam motorcycle. Oh, geez. Probably. <laughs> uh, I have some, uh, some very interesting gunpla at home. <laughs> yeah, but I've decided that people that are fans of anime, like, I don't I don't give a fuck as much about anime as, as this. Hey, look, it's our teacher. This Ida. I look forward to having you in class. Phrasing. <laughs> GHS is one of the most prominent gun club battle technical schools. Now, wait a fucking second. <laughs> is this like a trade school? Is this like the ITT Technical Institute for battling like little little well, mechanical robot guys? Apparently so. We study every aspect of the gun plot arts here. 
building, painting, remodeling, finishing. We also don't have math or science classes. <laughs> and of course, battle. But you'll have the, the skills needed to make little <laughs> models fight each other. Meow, 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 meow. What I don't understand, though, but see, here's the thing I don't understand about Gundam is you talk oh, about a tournament apparently about the about the one that came out last year, and I'm just like, why can't we just get a fucking like UC Gundam story based stage based video game? Like, well, they're making one right now. Oh, oh, good! It only took 20 years since the last one. It looks really good. I forget the name of it, but, but there, the one there is footage of it online right now. But I don't know if it's going to come out here. Is the only problem? Of course not, because happens a lot. <laughs> what we need is more of the. The Gundam Model High School games, obviously. People love them Sims. Yep, yep. Well, people love everything. Introduce yourself. Why do I even have an option? <laughs> I don't even know why why is there the even options? an option? Don't introduce yourself. Hi, Fuck I'm oh, random Japanese name. Yep. <laughs> I like Voltron. Oh! <laughs> wow, this is a lot of talking. <laughs> oh, no. No, we're only... Look. <laughs> we're only seven minutes into the jibber-jabber, super slow... Uh, 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 you know, anime introduction. We better not start with a GM is all I'm We got saying. 40 minutes left. We're going to start with a ball. <laughs> We're going to start ball to get used to the controls for 600 hours. To get a first-hand demonstration. Oh! They all fell down there. You didn't see that part. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, is she the fucking names? Is she the one that's... Oh, because she's uh, Ayanami she's Ray. representative. Yep. She's stoic. Oh, he gets to partner with Yori. Lucky. Ah, oh, what? Is she the uptight class representative that it turns out really just wants to have a good time, but she feels too pressured by her parents to be like a fine, upstanding girl? Oh, gee, I've never seen that part before. Sorry, well, I'm, I'm not trying to be. At a, she's at a trade school for Gunpla. I don't know how strict they have to be. <laughs> We're a little, little cranky today. I'm sorry. I'm going to try to dial it back a little bit. No, okay, I'm a little, great. Like, we've both had a very strange day. Uh, great. Complete the... God, could, they, could you make it tinier? Oh, could you thank make God. The, <laughs> the, could you make the writing smaller? At least we got the RX right away. Yeah. I was afraid well, it was going to be a GM. It's a fucking, fucking... There's nothing wrong with the GM. Oh, yeah, but GM I want Gundam. a Gundam. Like right away. Yeah, but I mean, you the know, Gundam. when you go out to dinner, you don't start with like beef. Like, you gotta get a salad Why don't in there you first. Start with beef. Some rolls, that you seems know. Pointless at that some, point. Some nacho chips and if you're and salsa, going out for dinner, you get the best item right when away. When you go to the Olive Garden, <laughs> first they bring you salad and then they bring you pasta. Oh, this is bad. Okay, here we go. <laughs> seems like you have some experience. No, I, I don't, but. Some people find themselves out of their element. Wait, so this is like a battle simulation. Then why are they putting us inside of like a comic book store? A lot of times these games have like actual like areas that are move with the left actual stick, places. Cross button to boost for rapid movement and depletes boost gauge. If the gauge is defeat, you will be unable to boost right. Okay. Yeah. Woo! Look at me. I'm in a tiny model in a comic book store. Cross button to jump in place, left stick with cross button to jump in a direction, the cross button again to execute why, continuous why does launch it up. actually say cross button, though? Because that's what they call it in Japan. Yeah, but why did why did they translate it to that here, though? Because it, they did they did a, a fucking find and replace. Uh, on the, it wasn't <laughs> it wasn't like, uh, okay. Look at all these cool posters, though. Look, look at all this, this cool shit. Yeah, it's not Hang really on. what I expect from a guy. Is the boost jump. <laughs> all right, let's do you just, you just hold it down. I think, I think it's wants you to do it. Yeah, <laughs> so you probably don't need me saying anything. All right, let's move on. To, let's go over the weapons. Square button or triangle button to attack with your melee weapon. Next, you combo attack. Sprint, square button or triangle. Push repeatedly in combination. All right, fuck you. Fight, trap, <laughs> swam it up. Black and burp. Okay, what R2 button pilot? to fire your ranged weapon, depleting the ranged gauge. Hold the button. Uh, all right, what do we got? Uh, ranged attack, R2 button. I'm doing it. Oh, it's a beam weapon, man. Yeah, he held that really awkwardly. Okay. Oh, and break the containers. What containers? Oh, oh there we go. Containers. Bam. Did I do it? Yeah, Yay. give me whatever that is. It's a, it's a gun plot piece. Huzzah. <laughs> you, know, you know, what? the funny thing about this, I'm talking a lot of crap. I used to do this. Like, uh, I, I used to work with a guy way back in, like, the 90s. He used to just, like, import a shitload of these things, and we used to just, like, go hang out at his house and build them and paint them and shit. Oh, okay. Um, to level up, increasing stats. I have a giant chunk of them because I buy them for with a so a friend can help build them. And man, yeah, this game is just freezing like every now and then. What do you think about EX skills? Uh, special moves linked to your gun plus parts. EX skills are locked at the start of each mission. To use them, raise your frame level in battle. 
Okay, so now I unlocked part repair. R1, press square button, triangle, circle button, or L1. Okay, so it's like an, a modifier. Oh, you can heal yourself. I yeah. That's what it is. Press R1, press cross button, or L1, press cross button when awakened to activate a powerful EX skill. Even without the parts, using the skill will awaken your... Okay. Jesus. <laughs> R3 button plus L3 button when the gauge is fully charged to awaken. This increases your power and restores your parts to the initial state, so it's great when you're in trouble. Okay. So oh let's see. Uh, <laughs> that's uh, Let's hold down R1 and... Nope. Okay. R1. Nope. Uh, R1 and circle button. Nope. I think you just do the R1 one that you have button. so far. Oh, okay. So that's restore. Use controls to break the container. Okay. Where's the container? Uh, I think it's up top. Oh, wait. I can see it on my map. I didn't even realize I had a map until oh, a minute ago. Wait. Oh, I can't. <laughs> wait. Hold on. Uh, is I it think on? it's up top. Can you, can you get up there? On top of what? Oh, there. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm going to hit it with my laser sword. But my hands goes. <laughs> um, it's, I guess it's just it's weird that, like, control, pick up parts, approach part, touch, pick it up. I guess it just seems weird to me that Gundam, which is such a such a such a very popular series with such a very like e an easily translatable thing, doesn't have just like a slew of fucking amazing video games. Like, there the last one that I remember, ooh, exchange, put that Zaku head on like a dork. Look at me, I'm a Zaku now. Oh, there's your there's your hated GM. GM. Yep, the GM is the. Is oh, the see, uh, she's getting all crazy. Look at her face. Oh shit! She's a crazy person. Yeah. <laughs> oh jeez. Yep. Now she's going all crazy. Yep. There she goes. All right. She needs, oh shit! Wait. She what? needs Fuck therapy. Off. Fuck off. <laughs> oh GM. Wait. Who am I fighting? Uh, just Is GMs, it her? I guess. I think she's going around destroying things. Break five containers. Okay. Well. Uh, this seems really bare bones compared to part three, though. So far, at least. Oh, uh, you know, without a without a frame of reference. Uh, oh shit! Fifteen neutral force units. Okay, let's try one of these new things. Bam! Oh, snapola! <laughs> you got all my fucking swords in your face. Let's try that again. Oh shit! I got messed up. Wait, what is this one? Oh, wait. Uh, get out! Move! Fucking run away! Just use the one that gives you back your health. Ah uh, shit! Yeah, that one's that one's in recharge right now. Uh, no, it's not. I think. Yeah, look, it's the one that's slowly charging back up. Oh fuck! It'll charge up faster the more you attack, from what I can okay. tell. Okay, blam, blam. Guess I'll fucking suck at this. The worst. I'm gonna rule the this comic book shop until the tiny soldiers, <laughs> the small soldiers, are coming though. The fun uh, thing about the the Gundam Breakthrough series though. Because every now and then you'll fight, like, bigger-sized models. Right. So you'll fight, like, giant Gundams because they're, they're different scales. Okay. Oh, the, it's actually pretty rad. Uh, oh, wait. I can exchange some parts. Uh, let's put in the Zaku machine gun. And what else we got here? Oh, that's a beam rifle. These GM feet. Yes, the legs. This is so weird. Like, why would I want to do this? I don't understand why I would be interested in having, like, this fucking mutant ap apocalypse uh, Gundam. People Wait. make some very creative uh, mobile suits, actually, with these things. Yeah. I had a Spider-Man-themed um, oh, burning, build burning Gundam. Oh, shit. Okay, so I can... America shield that threw things. Discard. And what is this? This is a, a chest, a Zaku chest. So just slowly... Oh, Zaku... Wait, is it a... Sh let? What did I just switch out? I don't know. Head? It's a different head. What did you? What is this crazy lady telling me now? I'm the just, perfect grade. You gotta, you gotta go beat up that perfect grade Gundam. Uh oh. Oh, the big one. Yeah. That's All a right. Perfect, that's a perfect grade. Uh, fucking eat shit. It's one of the higher, higher ones. Let's try one of the. Uh, one of the, uh, nope. That's a. It's do not anything. the. It's not the five foot one though. That one. That one's like a grand to buy in real life. I can't use my, uh, here, let's try Spite Shooter. Spite Shooter. Nope. Oh, shit. Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay. Can I use my, can I awaken yet? That was a whole uh, big thing, right? Uh, yeah, I think it's oh, your, shit. I think it's that meter on the left. Oh, uh, okay. The one that's circling around your head. Arr, you get some, you stupid big old Gundam, I will beat you up. Oh, shit. <laughs> Why are we doing this? I don't understand it. Let's keep doing it, though. Okay, I think now you can do it. Uh, awaken! Ah, parts out. What for Harambe? I don't know. I, <laughs> yeah, I was like, what? Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill my partner too. 
How do I know how much like health this fucking asshole has left? Uh, it's, it's that oh. tiny meter that was on him. Okay. She's just man. There's like sensory overload. Yeah, there's a lot. The, the thing about these Gundam games is a lot is happening. Yeah. Like, at all times. Like I've gotten somewhat used to it, but fuck, dude. Like shit. S rank. What's up? Shit is happening. What's up? I'm the best. <laughs> I'm the best at Gundam Breaker. Whatever new Gundam Breakers. Range GX damage up. Frame type increased damage. I got some Zaku parts. Ooh, I got some gun tank. Oh, it's a head. I want the body of a gun tank. I want well, the legs of a gun tank. The thing about this game is it has the same thing that a lot of games have where you can grind for pieces. Yeah. So you can be like this. Like, you you can look at a, mi a missions uh, thing. Yeah. Like, if you do this mission, you can get this this Gundam's parts or this mobile suit's parts. And then you play that same mission over and over, over and over. It's kind of like, a, like EDF or something like that. Yeah. Where you just... Okay. I kind of find that to be a little bit unsatisfying but it's great when you have friends to play it with yeah like I, I i did gun and breaker 3 and co-op the entire way through yeah and so i had a lot of fun with it because of that but it also is something you can play while like putting like a podcast in your ear and just go for it right it's one of the top ranked second years in the school think the new kid will give her a run for her money thank you boy b <laughs> they could have just put like Frank or like Gene or or. It had to be know. Japanese is the problem. They're like, well, Fuck it, we don't have time. Yui for this. or fucking Shiro or I don't know. You know, Shiro. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we'll have a free Gundam Gunpla battle time all day. Play video games. Yay. It's video game school. Man, this. Uh, I'm starting to regret this decision. <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh man, which kit should I use? Check out my super custom Zeo. Check out my losing kit. The thing about Gunpla, though, like as I, as I mentioned, is that people are really creative with these things. Yeah, like you'll see some like amazing fucking. Like I have a mobile suit that's designed from the Gundam Bill Fighters. Yeah, it's called the the Gundam Wing Finici. Venice, Venice. Okay, it's like a Venice, like Italian colored oh, Gundam shit. that has like a cape that makes it look kind of like a. Like a like an Italian swordsman kind of thing. It's pretty badass. Okay. And it's got a motorcycle and shit. It's it's they're designed to make me to make them money, and I keep falling for it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I you know I understand. Uh, it. Uh, uh, I understand. I think for me, it's just like I don't I don't like Gundam enough for this. Like I used uh, there was a time where I was interested in it, and I watched a bunch of it. Um, and then it's kind of like, eh, you know, it sort of fell off because it was all Wing Gundam for a while. Yeah. Um, and even even like the like full blooded Iron Blooded Orphans, I didn't like how uh, um, vicious the kid in there was. Like it. Was, I love I love Mika. Uh, I, I, I crazy motherfucker turned me the fuck <laughs> off. I wasn't interested in that. I liked the Unicorn. It's got a super depressing ending though. Um, I liked Unicorn a lot, and but then the Char one was a little bit was a little bit um, slow. Uh, Unicorn got a little slow, too. The prequel one with Char, uh, where it's like uh, his origins? backstory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm liking that one a lot, though. There's, they're still making these those even now. I See, that's the other thing is, I don't think that I like them enough to watch them as they come out. Like, I'm kind of just done until they're all out. Uh, yeah, they're pretty long, too. And uh, they're based on the manga that they've been making that you can also buy. Yeah. So. But yeah, it's all origin stuff. Uh, I mean, I'll still throw on... Uh, 08 MS team from time to time. That's probably my favorite one of and all the G Gundams. G Reco, though. Fuck that fucking place. <laughs> G Reco is so bad. What? Gundam G Reco. What is that? It's uh, it's supposed to be the final part of the, the UC timeline, I guess. Or it's, oh. it takes place after the UC timeline, actually. But it's so fucking bad. <laughs> Which one is it? I don't think I watched that one. It was um, it had the it had a, a Gundam called the G Self, and a character named Bellry. And it's man, if I if I get into it, I'm gonna go for like hours. Oh, okay. It's fucking it's bad. Like, let's just leave it. Ah, he, it's really okay. Bad. So here's this guy who he's gonna be very brash and he's not gonna like us very much. And then it's like maybe we'll be friends or maybe he'll be our nemesis till the end of the game. He looks like a mean Jimmy Olsen. It reminds me of uh, what's his name from Gundam or from uh, kind of from Persona Five. Uh, the blonde kid? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, can't remember his name right off the top of my head. Oh, he's got some bully, bully A. Sure, yeah. 
959. Ah! I love I love the the fact they're in a world where like I'm a better Gundam pilot than you, so you're a bitch. <laughs> right, right. Where the bullies at school are the the top. I played this virtual reality toy fighting game better than you. I even like the fact that he insulted him by like. Be, oh, it's, it, 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 like, oh God! What, what <laughs> world is this? I don't want to live in that world. It's an even weirder world than Gundam Build Fighters normally is for yeah. some reason. Well, also the fact that they're in like this futuristic high school. Like, are there actual Gundams in this world or what? Like, no, they, I, they put all their technology into toys. Oh, good. <laughs> yep, yep. I'm gonna mess with them. How dare you fight with a stolen part? Don't you have any pride? Who? Uh, <laughs> it's our buddy. Standing up to a bully. Bounces right off my yeah to know. I don't know what that means. Is that like a <laughs> Okay, yep. I, like I I I'm sure somebody's gonna tell me. Oh snap, the reflection system from a Katsui Gundam. No, that's a sick burn. <laughs> sick Gundam burn! I don't I don't know Gundam well enough apparently to know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> I wish my friend was here. He would tell me exactly what's happening. Oh, man. <laughs> You're not even team leader. Now give back my part. <laughs> There's a battle room over there. Let's see if you can back up your big mouth. I wonder if he's related to Pat Morita. What? The guy from uh, Karate Kid? No, I know who Pat Morita is. <laughs> but why did you think that he's related? Because they said his name was Morita. Oh. Like, I guess the trope racist, Morita. man. All Moritas are, are related to Pat Morita? Oh, man. Okay. Uh, it makes more sense than anything else that's happened so far. Well, you will. I mean, obviously, this entire. You know what? It, GQ rule. I don't know what any of this means. That's, <laughs> it's, fi it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Wait, what happens if you hit window off? Oh, then it just it hides it so we oh. can listen to the Japanese, that's right? That's very strange. Yeah. <laughs> Why would you put that in here? Uh -huh. <laughs> ah! <laughs> it's like a Speed Racer character. Yeah. Uh. Ha! My, all my teachers say that I have ADD. Now she's crying, I guess. She doesn't have any allies around. We're gonna, no, we're gonna help her. What do you mean, wait and see? <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. He's with the student. I don't give a fuck, Iori. I don't give a fuck. Okay, this is. I, I, the, you know what though? Okay, you know what? The one thing that I will say though Couple about of randos about this and about Japan is at least like if you're a big old fucking fan of Gundam, at least somebody in Japan has the good common sense to try to cash in on your fandom by giving you a game about th th this shit, right? Who the fuck are you? It's Rinko. <laughs> She's the broadcast club president, Rinko Shikuno. Wherever there's a battle, all of the commentator match. I must remind the audience that we've only played Gundam once in this 24 minutes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, of course we have. There was no way that we were going to play Gundam more than like three times. Gun we're we're gonna get, we're gonna barely get in the in the if we did two 45 minute parts of this, we would barely get to the point where you can kind of choose what you want to do, because. After we win this battle, then it's going to be like, oh, I'll fucking get you. And then it's like, ding it's what, dong, time for a test. And then it's kind of why it bothers me, though, because I, I like the Gundam Breaker 3 was this whole, like, mission. Like, it was a missions thing. Like, like you, you did a mission and you, mm -hmm. and you walked around, destroyed shit, doing badass, crazy fun shit. This is just, like, fighting and shit. Like, I should, I might as well just play Gundam Versus is what I'm saying. Yeah. So far. I don't know. You're supposed to be invested in the characters. You're supposed to care about what happens to Yori and fucking your kids like this guy. Oh, my God. Fuck is you, is that a fucking paint your shit, you ass. legs, Zaku head. Yep. Uh, all right, let's go. You don't know the rules of a GQ battle yet. Oh, God. I don't know what that means. Uh, <laughs> can I just kick his ass? Okay. <laughs> GQ is three on three. There will also be periodic quests that pop up. The team scores points. There are all kinds of quests. Just be strong in battle. Crush your enemies. Break open containers. Keep an eye out. Sometimes you'll find rare containers. Okay, great. In GQ match, the team that scores the most points within the time limit is oh, the winner. I think I did something like this in the other if one. If the enemy team clears a quest before you do, not only do they score the points, but the quest ends. Be aware of your opponent's actions. It's really important to recover parts with recovery key because you can keep the parts or rewards after battle. Okay? So you can customize your, your mobile suit. Huzzah! Uh, okie doke. Part recovery quests are set to award, blah, 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 blah. Let's go already! <laughs> right, I get it, lady. 
Yep. Can we can we move? Beat the loot to parts. Yep. Yep. She had that crazy look on her face. It's just weird as kids. Yeah, because whenever she goes into battle, she becomes a fucking crazy sadist. Yep. Well, All right, let's just try and learn about it. Okay. Oh, fuck you. Really All right. Uh, let's see, I gotta use this thing. Yeah, where's the uh, Where's the so enemy? Tiny. Oh wait, there they are. Come on, motherfucker. Trying to hit some girl in the hallway, you son of a bitch. Oh, fucking fuck Suck your life. Shogo, whatever the fuck your name fuck was. Fuck your life up. Don't think you were going to get away with this time. Oh, you bitch. Uh, I need more. I need, like, to get my heel back on. Oh, shit. Uh, we have another uh, mission where we ought to, like. Your heels are locked, though, so. Okay, well, there's one. There's we go. Uh, I gotta pick up more parts, I guess. What's up? What's up? Mission, uh... What's up? Urgh, urgh. I have no idea what's happening. <laughs> so flashing lights Shit are is everywhere. Exploding is what's happening. Yeah, what's up? I'm gonna shoot you. Level up, level two. Ex skill unlocked. It's the head Vulcan. Head Vulcan. Wait, I didn't think I did it. Wait, can I get away from this for like one fucking second? Why won't I do the head Vulcan? Was that even a quest? How did I? I don't I, even know what. How was I? Know? You gotta help me here, man. Oh, there it is. It's on, it's the, on the right side. Uh, okay. We now have break ten containers. Where, where are the containers? Help me. Uh, help me. Where are the containers? Uh, uh, there's <laughs> the containers. Okay. Uh, Damn it, Yuri. <laughs> where, where am I on this map? God, get off me, you shits! You're the. You're the circle. Uh, the, which the circle? You're the circle oh, with the arrow. Okay. In it. But I'm trying to figure out what the containers look like on here. Okay, destroy gun. Oh shit. Parts out. Wait, how can I do that? Ah, oh, fuck. Why didn't it? I was locked on, but I wasn't pressing in the right direction, and then it made my head cannon go somewhere else, which that's a weird... Oh, oh shit. My uh, my weapon is broken. You broke uh, your weapon? Yeah. Well, like, I don't have... My weapon doesn't do anything anymore. Oh, okay. You okay, so exchange. How do I put this? No, exchange. Okay. Break 10 containers. We did a team. Put this on. <laughs> Uh, put this on. I don't even know what. I don't give a fuck. Well, just put them all on. <laughs> put them all on. There's a gun. Uh, all right. Put the gun up. Oh shit. What's the what's the what's the thing? What's the uh the quest line destroy right now? Destroy twenty units. Okay. And also destroy the target. What's this? Oh shit. What's up? It's the head of a GM. Up? You son of a bitch. <laughs> I will come over to your house. I will I will take all your models down. I will play with them until they are <laughs> gross and they've got like little kid. Putting pop fingerprints all over them. Oh, you son of a bitch. You get back here. Destroy Gaian. Who's that? What does that no mean? No idea anymore. Oh, the Put gun the, tank. To destroy the gun tank. Put on these hands. And then drop the rest of this horse shit. Whoa. Oh, shit. Where's okay. the tank? Oh, there it is. Oh. Oh, gun tank right there. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, get him. Oh, the Gaians. Uh, no, where is he? Where do you go? Where do you go? Fuck, there he is. No. Fucking bases and shit. Oh, there's like a <laughs> lot of them. Okay. Fuck, I just got a few of them. Uh... I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Uh, this is so. I'm so this is really straight. Like, uh, even I'm a little uh, confused as to what is happening now. Uh, get the tank, get the tank. I don't care about the rest of this. Get the tank. Ah. Uh, are we winning? I, are we, I, are we winning? What are know. the points like at the top? Uh, yeah, we got nine right now. Okay. Now we, now we gotta beat them up. Which one? Them, Who? the enemy team. Yes, but okay. Where are they? I. Hard to that, differentiate. That guy's one there we of them. go. Okay, I think I just killed him. I think he just exploded. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think he was almost dead. So, don't quit picking up parts. We're having a fight, you jag. Well, that was one of the missions. Three parts. Here, I'm gonna get that. Oh man. Okay, now we got to beat up Shogo. Oh shit. Recover Johnny Ridden's Gelug. Oh, it's the enemy team's cube, motherfucker. Yeah. What's up? Exchange the parts. I don't understand exactly how the part exchange thing. Well, is that like giving me extra health? Like if my parts get broken, and I'm supposed to pick up more other parts? I don't know, because that's a uh, new thing. That wasn't in any of the other games. Like you just used your parts, and that was it. Okay. Like you didn't have the ability to exchange mid-battle. Like I don't know if I should. Should I be exchanging these parts? I don't know. Uh, I don't even know what they do. <laughs> oh shit! Like I'm, I'm trying to figure out exactly what it does, and I just have no idea. Uh. I feel like though we're winning the fuck out of this fight. Like I don't know what we're doing, I don't but know we either. are. Okay, wait, hold on. What is it? Uh, oh, okay. So it actually shows you what. Uh, okay, I get it. I get it. I get it now. So okay, we see when you bring the parts up. I'm gonna try to do this while I'm fighting. You see how it says at the bottom, like it shows you what 
what ability you'll get for putting that part on. Oh. So when you put it on, now it's like I have the this ability or whatever. Won, but I guess. I don't know what just happened. I, I yeah, I don't know either. Though, apparently. Yep. We well, did we were 21 to around. zero. You got housed. Housed. And I'm Take that, Pat Marita's brother. <laughs> fourth fourth place. And I don't I think I got an S somehow. I don't yeah. Know. <laughs> I'm the best at this fucking game. You guys saw all the shit blew up and I didn't. And that's all that matters. <laughs> and I got a, some Dom arms uh, from, from obviously from the Fast and the Furious. I got <laughs> Johnny Ridden's Gilug high mobility type what? legs. <laughs> and I got a gear dogu. Yep. Yep. Acquire all new parts. Yep, do it. Let me let me customize my shit. I can't believe this is the Gundam game I finally convinced you to play. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying Gundam Versus came out when there was other stuff out, and I wasn't interested in that game. Uh, I this, mean, in general. This in game general. came out. <laughs> there hasn't been a new Gundam game besides that. I like guess that's fair. <laughs> yep. We win. We beat up Jimmy Olsen. Yeah. <laughs> Shogo, Shogo mad. He's Shogo mad. Nobody believes was. you, Shogo. You're the worst. Shield of Lap Lapis? That's what they're called, right? Yeah. That's something from Gundam. It's like the Lap House of Lapis. I think that was even in like Unicorn or something like that. Most likely. Uh, right. For as much Gundam as I've watched, there's a lot of things I don't memorize. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I've seen a lot of them, <laughs> luckily. Favorite Gundams are always MST. Yeah! Yuri is the best! Thunderbolt, oh, Thunderbolt's pretty rad. Have you seen Thunderbolt? No. It's it's another UC one. That's really fun. Okay. Dark as fuck, but really fun. <laughs> yeah. Um... Like it's about a, a guy, uh, a um, a Xeon soldier who doesn't have arms or or doesn't have legs, uh -huh. who's fighting a douchebag Federation dude. Okay, he's really in the jazz. Okay, and so whenever like he flies around his mobile suit, he's playing jazz. Okay, and they give the guy they give the guy a Gundam because he's like the highest ranking dude because everyone has died. Right, and in a battle. And so everyone's terrified of it. And so he, the the guy without legs decides he's gonna pilot this this prototype Zaku that he needs to not have arms for. Uh huh. And so he wait, legs or arms? Which one does he not have? Well, he he doesn't have arms after because he needs to not have arms to pilot it correctly. Oh. And so, so then he becomes quadriplegic. Well, they have like these robot arms and legs that are like super like. Okay, wait. Oh, wait, like, wait. They're not like really. Back, back, back it up for a second. The guy doesn't have legs. Yeah, he lost them in in, the, in a normal ground fight. Right. And then he's piloting a Gundam that they have to cut his arms off. No, it's a, it's, a, it's a special Zaku, or, right? That, that they um they designed to like react to you faster if you just have if you just stick your arms and your legs into it essentially. Okay. Like because it reacts faster for some reason. Okay. And so he he volunteers to like beat up this this guy in his Gundam. But how does he do that if he doesn't have any legs to put in the leg parts? Well, no, he he has the robot legs though. Okay, when you say robot ma legs, you mean the, in the Zaku. Yeah, this, well, like yeah, the Zaku itself, he, you just they have right. these like, like he has like these metal like tips that stick out that connect to it. Okay. And then like he moves around with it, kind of thing. And they cut off his arms as well. Yeah, well, cool, yeah, because he he volunteers for that part. So he's a quadriplegic after that. No, he still he still walks around and stuff. That is okay. Just take the robot out. Take the robot out of the equation. All right. I want to yeah, talk about they the guy. Have, they the have... guy has no legs. Yeah, but they have like super like. Not he's got not, prosthetic they're... legs. Yeah, yeah. He has prosthetics that okay. are like super detailed. Okay. And he also has prosthetic arms as yes. well. Okay. All right. Yeah. Okay. So you were confusing me with your question. Well, about. you said he had no legs, and then you're like, yeah, he, has he has no legs. legs. So he and then like he puts his legs, legs in the thing, and I was like, but you didn't mention the robot legs. I totally did, though. You did not. But I see, thought I did. Okay, listen. If Never you did mind, mention the robot legs, then we were talking about a giant robot. So I was like, which robot legs are we talking about? Well, now we're talking about his normal robot legs. Okay, was, but even that is not because he he was in a unit full of people who had lost like limbs, right, and stuff. So they all like have like different.
different robotic parts. Okay, but see that part, that information was not in the initial description. Well, see, yeah, that's that's fair. <laughs> that's fair on that one. But yeah, because I was like, uh, what? <laughs> I mean, like, I'm not no judge or anything. Like, it sounds kind of cool, personally. But yeah, um, the entire thing's on YouTube, though. If you ever get a chance, the Gundam Info, the Gundam Info YouTube channel has a bunch of like random Gundam shows on it. Hmm. And uh, Thunderbolt is really is I think is really good. It takes place in like a random battle. In the middle of um, the UC timeline, the, uh, the one year war. Okay, all right. It's, it's, um, it's getting some really fucked up moments in it, though. I think it's time to see if we can get one more here because, uh, <laughs> yay, sure. Whatever is happening. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, anyway, the I think we're times gonna... on this are very strange. What do you mean? Like, cause it'll like it'll randomly like freeze up. Yep. Every now and then, and we're on a pro, I mm -hmm. mind you. Yep. So I don't even want to know what this is like on a normal PlayStation 4. I wonder if I can't remember when I loaded it up if it's super sampling or not. Um, I don't. Th I don't know that it is, but uh, that might be. I mean, I've actually run into a couple of games where you have to turn super sampling off, like that'll cause problems with it. But well, I was um, I was reading up on on Reddit before I came over here that uh, every the entirety of Japan hates this game. Okay, because it's just not like ooh free. Oh, oh. hey, cutscene with a robot in it. Oh, wait, but it's still a little small robot. That's another I'm person. for my pride! Okay. It's a lot of different parts. Uh, wait, are, so are we tiny, but we're, like, in a base or something? Yeah, what it is is now you're, like, these are actual, like, areas that they set up you, for the toys. Oh, God damn it. Quit bogarting the fucking... <laughs> oh, God damn it, I don't want to lock onto that. I want the parts. I need the parts to get powered up. There we go. Oh, God damn it, oh, really? shooting the shit out of you. <laughs> Really? Okay, uh, God, get off of me! Uh, there we go. Wait, how come I didn't fire? You did fire. Uh, did I? I saw you fire. I don't understand any part of what's going on in this video game. I don't either. Uh, <laughs> I'm done. Uh, anyway, thanks everybody for watching. <laughs> Hit the like and subscribe button if you'd like to see these videos a day earlier. You can always head on over to RageSelect.com where you got all kinds of fun stuff. No, wait, am I actually putting the head on or not? Or is this like a... No, you just have the backpack right now. You don't have a head. Okay, but oh, I was trying to put it on and it wasn't... I was hitting the... Literally hitting the buttons. Am I doing it? There we go. Okay. Uh, I feel like it wasn't actually making the parts. Oh. Is that one of my team? Oh, okay. You failed one of the quests, I guess. Uh, okay. Oh, now the quest is break 10 containers. Uh, I would like to put these feet on. Exchange. Is there like a cooldown on on switching? What or? I can do? I don't know. I'm I'm thoroughly well, yeah, confused there's a, by there this There is a cooldown on at least on the, the thing on the, the bottom right, at least. Well, not that. I'm talking about like switching parts. Oh, that. Because uh, sure. I feel like I can't. I would. I feel like I have to get more depth into this before I can really get off me, sink bro, sink bro, it. bro. Um. Anyway, uh, sorry if this has been multi very confusing for people. I. <laughs> This game is not doing anything for me. Uh, it's it's generic anime. It's not even doing anything for me, which is kind of sad because I love I love these Gundam games. Yeah, and that's, uh, that's that's saying a lot, I think. Okay, so we got part repairs. Uh, anyway, hit the like, subscribe button, or, or hit the dislike button. I don't really care at this point. It's fine. <laughs> I, just, I know that at there's going to be this one specifically. somebody <laughs> who's going to be. I, I've kind of reached a point though where the, uh, I'm I'm largely just don't give a fuck anymore. Uh, if everybody like really, really uh, hates this video, then I'll, I'll probably take it down like I did a Shack video or whatever. But like, uh, anyway, a like, subscribe, hit the thing, <laughs> let us know in the comments how we don't know anything about anything. That's this fine. Gundam breaker, I, I think, it's, broke us. It's uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> give me the tank. No, give me the tank legs. I don't care about the rest of this fight. I want the tank legs. Put the there. Tank. there. All right, now put them on. Put them on. Uh, God, exchange. There you go. Yeah. yeah! All right, now I'm really stupid See, now looking. This, now this game Woo! got better. <laughs> Woo! Everybody, get out of my way. I got these tank legs. Yeah, tank best game I've ever played in my entire life. <laughs> yeah, get some. Ooh, shit. Just get knocked the fuck around. the fuck? Get my tank legs. Um, tank treads. Patreon.com forward slash rage slash where you can go to help us out, kick us some bucks in return. We'll get you bonus videos that nobody else gets to. See? Uh, it is how this website and the YouTube channel remain uh, ad-free and completely clear of all the horse shit that you normally see on other. You don't have to watch any ads before you watch these videos. So if you can afford to kick us a couple of bucks, help us out, and uh, we would greatly appreciate it. Uh, if you can't do that, I'm going to have some Amazon links down below. So if you want to buy this or if you want to uh, buy anything, 
um, off of Amazon. Do us a favor and start at the links that are down below, and we will get a piece uh, uh, of whatever it is that you buy. So Amazon gives us a, a piece of, of reference or a piece for us putting that down there. Uh, I don't know. You should probably go watch somebody who, who knows a lot about this game say that this why this game is good or, or not good because I, quite frankly, the, the game part is like just having a seizure. Oh, jeez. Uh, but I didn't even put the head on. I feel like I was trying to put put on I don't know the Zaku the pod. Now, did I do it? Okay, I did oh, it. You have soccer legs now. GM2 head. Can I put the GM2 head on? See, that's not a GM2 head. Is it? Or was that a back no, GM just, backpack? I think that's the back. Wait, I don't know what just happened. Gundam. Here's a Zaku 2 feet. I keep, like, things keep coming on and off of me, and I don't understand what they are. And I'm, 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 I'm not frightened. Uh, I'm cold. Oh, I don't know uh, where I am. Fun fact. If you decide to buy something off Amazon, you can you can import Gundam Breaker 3, the Break Addiction edition. I think it's called the Break Edition. Okay. Off of Amazon for, like, 70 bucks. Okay. It's, 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 there's, it's, this, it's a Malaysian version that has an English... An English subtitles thing, and it's actually hella fun. Okay. I know that one's hella fun. It's like this one, but is it like this? Is it one of these? Do I have to go, to go back to Gunpla High School in order to... No, it's like a quick arcade thing, and they're all mission-based. Oh, okay. Like, everything's an actual mission. Like, you, you're not just fighting random... Mo like, you're, you're fighting random mobile suits, but it's more of a mission. Like, it's it's more like a beat-em-up than, okay. than this is. Like, this is more of a... Fi you fight each other, but the other one's like a beat-em-up. Like, yeah. You're fighting waves of, of things... And having badass combos and like badass, you have like so much fucking shit you can do in Gundam Breaker Three. Sure. Compared to what's happening in this game. Sure. Which but that's the same franchise, right? Yeah, but I found it. It's the, it's a completely different developer. Okay. And so it, apparently, it's a huge step back. This one. Yes. The new one. Yes. Okay. This one's a huge step back from Three because Three actually has a shit ton of good reviews. Okay. This apparently this actually dropped in price in Japan like already. It's well. Wait, how long has this been out in Japan? Because it came out today. I think it. Came, I think it's only been out the same, the same amount of time. I think they both came out around the same time. Interesting. Well, in any case, uh, Michael, where can people find you on the internet? You can find me on oneofus.net. Uh, we did a review for Jurassic World. Yeah. You can also find me here on Rage Select on the podcast, probably that will come up the same day, right? Uh, yes. Yeah. Later today. Mm -hmm. Yep. You'll enjoy that. <laughs> I guarantee that at least. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah, this has been New Gundam Breakers. I'm so glad that I played Mario Tennis. <laughs> I'm going to go back to playing Mario Tennis right now. It makes so much more sense, even though it's a world that literally is based on tennis with Mario and friends, because at least it's not fucking Gundam High School.